Okay, uh, we need to talk about some jargon. Uh, there are some special kinds of matrices you need to know about. Since we did matrix multiplication, you need to know about an identity matrix. And so an identity matrix is what you would think it is. And the identity matrices have to be square. Uh, and it's usually you write it as i n by n for whatever n is. And let's do an example of this. So if you have, uh, we'll let a be a, b, c, d, some generic two by two matrix, two by two. And then clearly, so all identity matrices look like this. It's ones down the diagonal, starting high left, going low right, and zeros everywhere else. So in this particular case, this looks like uh, one, zero, zero, one. This is also a two by two matrix. And of course, you know uh, the number of columns in this first one is the same as the number of rows in the second. So it's going to work. And this means it's going to spit out a two by two. And let's see what kind of matrix it spits out. And at this, uh, I'm just going to kind of wave hands in here. Hopefully, you're feeling somewhat comfortable for this. For this first position right here, this is the C11, first row, first column. A times 1 is A plus B times 0. This is just A. Uh, for this position here, this would be um, C12, first row, second column. A times 0 is 0. B times 1 is B. Uh, for here, this would be uh, the C21 position, uh, second row, first column. C times 1 plus D times 0 is C. And this is going to be the C22 position, uh, second row, second column. C times 0 plus D times 1. I showed you what you were probably going, dude, I already see this uh, coming. It, it spit back. So you have this A times I is usually how it is. This is just equal to A. And this is one of the few occasions in matrices where uh, A times I is actually equal to I times A. And we'll probably do this as an exercise just to make sure you feel comfortable with this. Identity matrices play a huge part in what's coming up, Gauss-Jordan elimination and some other things. So we need to know about that. There are some other uh, matrices that you need to know about. Um, a transpose. If So a generic matrix, um, you would look like this. If A, and you'll see this notation, and this will drive you crazy because it's going to seem so uh, abstruse. But so here is a generic matrix, A, I, J. Oopsie. All right. So this is just a, a matrix. And it can be an M by N, whatever. It's some generic matrix. What is the transpose of A? The transpose of A takes the rows of A and pulls them out of context, flips them down, and makes them into columns of A transpose, which means that this is now an N by M matrix. And all of these entries, the AIJs, get turned to AJI. So once again, you're probably glazed over by now going for your phone to look at a text message. Let me just show you how easy this is. Easy, easy, easy. So let's let A be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. As we already know, this is a 2 by 3 matrix. So A transpose is going to be, we take the first row of A, grab it, pull it out, crank it down as a column. So this is 1, 2, 3. Then we take the second row of A, grab it, crank it down, put it up as a column. 4, 5, 6. So look what we got here. This is a 3 by 2 matrix. And now let's see that these things are really changed up as they're supposed to be. Uh, this, uh, let's see, 3. In matrix A, this is a 1, 3, right? First row, third column. Where is the 3 in here? This is, and I'm probably getting a little low, sorry. So this is the third row. This is A transpose, but we'll just call it A. This is, well, you know what? We'll put AT, just to be more clear. This is AT. Um, three, one. So you'll notice the indices change on these. And here's what's really going to happen. As you go through your coursework, you're going to start doing some really uh, high-end stuff with matrices. <laughs> There's a goat in here. High-end stuff with matrices. Very high-end stuff. Um, you're going to be doing uh, principal component analysis and uh, single value decompositions, singular value decompositions. 
you're going to have to start being more comfortable with these notations, and you will. Trust me, you will. You totally will.